Yes, guys, welcome back to the Good Enough Podcast. We are here every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Now, to get started, I just want to give a round of applause to my boy right here. Oh, yeah. Because the first time ever he was on time when I went to pick him up in my entire life, he was waiting outside and I didn't have to lie about it. I said, I'm two minutes away. He was downstairs and I pulled up. I don't think, are you feeling all right? I feel good today. Do you know what it is? It must be. It's because of the amount of times you've complained about it. I know. So I now. love how it's uh, 12.48 and you're drinking Hennessy and Red Bull. Horror mixture. Back on it again. You know what I mean? Listen. <laughs> Look what you lot doing to him. No, listen, do you know what it is? I don't sleep enough. This, this, this podcast is a bad addiction for you. This isn't, a, this isn't a good one. Every time I come here, I drink. Yeah, what? <laughs> if you ain't driving. You used to be on it every day, though. Yeah, I know you did, to be fair. <laughs> you did. You did. Yeah, yeah. Bad so what's going on? How's life? It's all right, mate. Yeah. I mean, yeah, yours must be all right. It looks like Shandy. It's nice, brother. Trust me. Have a sip. <laughs> Have a sip. Go on. I don't even like Henny as it is. No, trust oh me. my god. It's actually that, a good mix. That smells like nail varnish. Oh my god. Yeah. The fucking, the, <laughs> <that as> well. <laughs> Laura mixed it for me. Oh, no. Is that how you like your drinks? Um, <laughs> but today we're going to uh, go into the episode with a few questions. We asked you a lot on our story. Go follow us on Insta if you don't already. Just type oh, in the Good Enough Podcast or Good Enough Pod. It will come up. You know the logo. Um, but yeah, we're going to go through some questions that we asked you lot over on Insta. <laughs> Sorry. That's fine. <laughs> Strength's a tune, isn't it? <laughs> you know, when I thought he was going to give me a round of applause, I thought he was going to say, because of one by one. <laughs> For you fucking... You got a first question. <laughs> it's <from> me. <laughs> I, just, I was bored last night. I thought, how big's Michael's question Corey? Is, how, how big's Michael's Corey? Huh. Cool. Let's have a look at it. <laughs> non- it's you. Yes, yeah, me. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, it's me. Obviously, yeah. That's why it's the first one. Uh, just clocked. All right. Non-sexual turn on. Non-sexual turn on. Straight away Ooh. to my head. I know what yours is. I've got a couple. I know. I know. Okay, I'll name a couple of Johnny's before Go I name well kept feet. Yep. That's the funny thing. White I'm toes, isn't it? White with a white French toes. tip. French, French tip. tip. White toes is a bit old um, school now. I reckon. What now? It's a, it's just someone who just looks after themselves. Good Hygiene, manners. Good manners. Manners. Yeah. Confidence. Yeah. Their turn on. Yeah. Confidence. I think I think it's just what being well kept for me. Yeah. Like, if you look mad presentable and like you're you're like you're 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 dressing all right, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, no, it smells. It's smells hygiene. is a big thing. Got to be fair, I, don't really, I, ain't really, I ain't really met girls that, that, that smell like that. Johnny has oh, Fuck, you know. <laughs> I know you. I ain't really met a smelly girl. But, <laughs> <laughs> but like, it's just be, like, you look mad presentable. It's like, wow. Yeah. Like, like, you take your time this morning. Even, I think you can get away with them not being done. Your fingernails. Yeah, yeah. But like, at least be... put some, a lick of paint on your toes or something. <laughs> That's what I think. Anyway. Put a lick of paint on your toes. Them, sang, but to be fair, what if the toes ain't out all the time? It's all right. But they be I reckon out. these are, these are yeah, out I'm more out. than these. These what? are out more, your hands are out more than your feet. Yeah, but like, still, you don't have to get his feet done. But at least have them a colour. Because you're like a bloke. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Told you before that one of my boy's exes fucking was in uh, out of rave and she was wearing some Birkenstocks. And was like, oh, First of all, for me, Birkenstocks ain't a thing Terrible. for me. Terrible, Terrible shoe. It's just like Crocs. When did Crocs become trendy? Nah, I like disagree. Crocs. Crocs are awful. No, but I'm not wearing it outside. But Crocs. Though. Still, nah. When, when, about five years ago, Crocs <laughs> were the neakiest, shittiest shoe to ever grace this earth. Everyone used to rip them, and then all of a sudden they're popular. Yeah, they're, they're comfortable. They're, they're, you, nah, they're terrible. They're a horror. <laughs> you know, like no, I you're a sliders terrible. man. Look, always, always a sliders. Yeah, I like sliders, but but these are their day. Fucking hell, <laughs> I don't even do these ones anymore. The brown ones. They don't. No, I got my fucking wallet pickpocketed in Ibiza. A brown Damier one. And uh, yeah, some arsehole just took it out of my bag when I weren't looking in the dance. And uh, I went to go get another one and it discontinued the brown. So I thought, cool, let me go on StockX, see how much it is. It's gone up by 400 quid. Yeah, you don't want that. But love, I ain't getting that. Yeah, yeah just, so you, don't don't like, you, don't, you don't love it that much. I think Louis' new color is blue, isn't it? Like they like the blue, oh, yeah, the like blue, black. Yeah, I've seen a blue, black thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I think brown's the best. Brown looks nice mm-hmm. still. So yeah, well, so, your, so your ones? Yeah, I think just confidence. Um, Nice feet, well kept, hygiene. Nice yeah. teeth. Teeth is a big thing. Yeah, if you've got a nice smile. My 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 ex used to look had a thing with teeth. Probably why she broke up with me. No, no, no. 
What's your biggest regret? Biggest regret? Um, I don't know what everyone's going to say. Bait squad. Um, but no, that's actually not my biggest regret. I don't regret. think it is your biggest, nah. Uh, just went my path. That's the way I see it. I think life's written. You know what I mean? Mm. Um, biggest regret? I don't really have many regrets. I don't think you should live in regret. I think I, I hate them people that like dwell on the past so much and let it eat them alive. Like fucking hell, get over it. Yeah, you I can't change it. I don't think I got a regret. Uh, I'm a big believer in it is what it is. Like that, it's done now. I was um, out the other week and um, some girl I know, uh, <laughs> her dad died um, like five days before I was out of her. And she brought up whatever. And I was like, fucking hell, you must be like distraught, blah, blah, blah. And she was like, yeah, of course I am, but it's done now, isn't it? What's the point of crying she about said, it? Yeah. It's true, I hear it. I hear like, I'd be heartbroken, but at the same time, it's like, what can you do? It is done. I hate like my, my brother's a prime example, yeah? If, if something ain't going my way or something I can't change has now happened, I'll be like, cool, what's the point of stressing? Like when I crashed my car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As soon when as you I crashed your car, you was like, it's done now. Zooming for like Two minutes minute. and then you was like, done. Yeah, and then I'm like, well, what can I do? It's done now. Not going to be going around going, oh, oh, we shouldn't do that. Oh, bring yeah, yeah, everyone yeah. else down. Yeah. Joe will fucking do it over. You're making a tune the other day, accidentally deleted all the files, had to re-record it. Had all the lyrics in his notes, so but he had to re-record it. It's a little minor hump in the road. Yeah. He, for about 20 minutes, oh, bro, that's so annoying. Oh, I'm gonna have to record it again now after every take. Oh, for God's sake, why well, have to do this again? It's not gonna be the same thing. I said, shut the fuck up. Just bro. do it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it, you can't change it now. What's the point? Yeah, how many times has happened to me? Like, that's, that's normal. It's got to firm it's it. It's got to firm it. It's such a healthier mindset as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do you regret anything? Um. Maybe, okay, I'll say the only regret I have is, I'll tell you when I got this regret. The, the, when my grandma died, yeah, mm. at a funeral, there was, like, they put up, like, a, there was, like, a slideshow in it. Family pictures and that, whatever not. I wasn't in one picture. <laughs> <laughs> I thought to myself. How's that regret? Because I, re I regret not spending more time with my grandma. Oh, is it? Yeah, because oh, I yeah, thought to myself, that. like, then it made, at the time, it made me have a little flashback, and I thought, right, every single time... My mum or my sister or Saturn is even, oh, let's go do this for your grandma. Let's go do that. Let's go. I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm coming. And I never, I never turn up. Yeah. No, you got to remember. And I think to myself, oh shit. Like, <laughs> I wish I spent, yeah. I wasn't in one photo, bro, not one. Like is genuinely, it? I'm talking extended family was in photos. I wasn't okay. in one photo. Yeah, I go, I make sure I go see my nan all the time. Got to. You got to, innit? Because you never know where they're going to take yeah. over. Like, you know what I mean? You know, my grandma raised me like, I at least should have just, you know, Spend some time with her. Oh, fuck it. Don't matter if you're not in the pictures, though. It does, but it don't. I wasn't in the pictures because... But then you that's what yeah, triggered yeah, the memory yeah, yeah, for me yeah, to yeah. think, well, to be fair, I'm not in the pictures, yeah, but I didn't even spend much time with you Yeah. after a while. I did, but like, just nipping it out. What's going on? You know what I mean? That's right. She won't mind now. She won't mind. <laughs> she ain't going to shank it now. <laughs> she ain't going to get Fuck. Why is this... Why are we laughing at that? I don't know. It's just true, though, isn't it? It's true, though, isn't it? It's true, isn't it? She don't give a shit now. She don't give a shit. <laughs> She ain't got a shit to give. <laughs> you know what I mean? She has no consciousness. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, cool. Uh, oh my God, this is what this is what someone, people keep asking this now. I've got, I'm going to look after a couple of people now. Any update on a girl with the kid as a profile picture that you were chatting to? Hmm? You saw a girl in Winter Wonderland. She was 10-10. Oh, 10, 10. oh, oh, she had a profile, oh, she had a profile oh, fucking hell. You lot are bare invested, innit? I forgot about that completely. Um, I think I've been on Follow her. What the <laughs> fuck? So it, didn't go, it didn't go nowhere? No, it didn't go nowhere. I think uh, she gave me a private Insta, like 25 followers, because she must have had a fellow or something. I don't know. Because oh. in Winter Wonderland, she seemed off game. And then when I messaged her, um, she didn't give me her number either, just private Insta. When I messaged her, I was like, go out for a drink or something. She didn't. Didn't even Brush. open it, and you follow twenty five people and got twenty five followers. Yeah, but you didn't see it. But you didn't see it. Yeah, so I just thought, oh yeah, I left it a week and I'm followed her. Fair. <laughs> you know what I mean, salt, but in a straight our way, I thought, yeah, ain't that red flags, man? Red flags, hundred percent. So I was talking about with Philly, like if a girl gives you a number on night out and says she doesn't have social media, she's capping. She's got a fella. I mean, yeah. go through with it, it's boys, if you want. You know what I mean? Like, it's nah. not you're not in the wrong, but you know what I mean. They're definitely capping. Who don't have social media of some sort? In this generation, no, no, even no. if you got a little private account, you got, 60, you got, you got sixty it. followers. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Yeah, like people do go through phases of deleting stuff, but bruv, come on now, you know what I mean? Saving or spending money in your twenties? 
there's two there's two sides to it because you'd want to make you'd want to make all the memories you can, but at the same time you think, well, if I'm earning, you save it, put some away. Yeah, the way I the way I see it, yeah, is if you're earning a decent amount of money, then of course you should put some away. But at the same time, it's like imagine you die at 25. You're pissed. Some people do die at a young Some age. I mean, that. you could walk out tomorrow and get by a bus. And then imagine you've saved from 20 to 25. All your boys going on holiday, doing all these things. You're missing out on you're everything. You're missing out on all their memories, and now you're in a coffin box and you ain't done fuck all. It can't bring that money with you. Do what do you, you know want, what I mean? basically. <laughs> if, you, if you're earning just like nine to five minimum wage, blah blah. blah be actually, responsible. No, just no, be responsible. I'm saying, no, I'm saying good. it's fucking hard to save. Yeah. Know? Like it's hard to save, bruv. A lot of my boys that do a normal graft, bruv, it's hard for them to save. You got to think about, say, like, what's minimum wage? I don't even know what minimum wage is. What is it, like 1,300 quid a month? Something like that. that. Like, after you've got all your bills paid now, there's not a, there's lot, not a lot there. There's not a lot there. It's fucking hard to save. I, 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 I see something, I think Elon Musk said it on Twitter. Um, it was, uh, it's easier to increase your monthly revenue by a grand than it is to save a grand a month. Is it? If you think about it, if you, well, yeah, I guess because so your, your mindset about mindset's... cool, I want to yeah, level yeah, up now, more... bomb. Yeah, rather than oh, I'm just gonna put this away, put this away, put this away. Why don't you actually try and increase your revenue? So it's easier I mean? to just get more bread. Yeah, and if you're earning minimum wage, you might as well just spend. Might it. as well just go spend. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Might as well have a good time because like How you're about... trying to save like hundred quid a month. You've got eleven hundred quid by the end of the year. Yeah, you know just what I mean. Make... And you're putting yourself out of like. I think shitty motives in England is different, but holidays. The holidays and stuff like that, I'd say like, let it go. Memories. You're going to yeah. make good memories and you're going to have more fun. And you're going to, well, even when you come back, you're going to come back with a bit of a buzz. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's going to last longer. Yeah. Like you're going to feel happy within yourself. Yeah, word. But if you're earning enough to save, then obviously put some away. I'd say it's like a, I don't really follow this ideology, but ideology, this fucking routine. But I'd say spend 60, save 40. Save 40. But I'd probably do like 80, 20, to be honest. Mm. <laughs> It's not good. Twisted. What's the most down bad you have been? <sighs> Driving bare far. Yeah, J nah, Johnny, Johnny. And then, nah, and then as it. soon as the deed's done, I think, what am I Johnny, doing? Two Johnny's, hours away Johnny's from my crew. Me, Johnny's told me stories where he's driven hours, hours. I'm no more than two. No more than two. No more than two. <laughs> Sometimes sitting in traffic, he's like, oh, for fuck's sake, what? Fuming. <laughs> no, the way there, I'm not fuming. On the way, yeah, the way there, you're not fuming. Way back, I'm out. Like, way back, you're pissed. But that's what I, that's I've what... stayed at a girl's yard before. She was like two hours away. I, uh, she had work in the morning. I left at seven thirty. I was sitting in Russia the whole morning. I'll be her. fuming. I was fuming and it was baking as well, sweating. <laughs> my aircon didn't work in my motor. Oh my god! I was so <laughs> angry. I'm not doing it like that. No, on the yeah, wall. <laughs> just sitting there, fucking foot going. What am I doing? <laughs> Won't even worth it as well. Dead beat. Nah, dead. <laughs> now I'm like probably fucking. So oh no, I know who it was. Bleep this. It was a. Uh, you're gonna make me all get you. <laughs> oh, yeah, that yeah, 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 yeah. That thing made me cringe. Uh, wait. I shall say that, yeah, fuck it. Yeah, go on, go on. You can say that. That's that's Yeah. So basically I was uh I, I went to stay at Bird's house, um, she had her own yard and that. And fucking that's actually a funny story, bro. I can't I'll tell the whole thing. Did I say what happened about her son? Yeah, so come on. She had a kid in it. Oh please, nah. It's this a, is a clip. Remember this 2021? 2020? Yeah, yeah, go on, go on, go on. Um yeah, fucking. So I went to this bird's house uh, and I'm obviously going, going down on her now. Thinking, yeah, she's a good looking girl, blah, blah, blah. They weren't really intact, but you know what I mean? Uh, she had a kid in that, so you got it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Lower. But fucking, um, yeah, I was like that. Cause I, when it's nice, I like doing that shit. Um, and then she went, oh, you're gonna make me all get you. I thought, oh. So wait, I went like that. You went down on it. After that, you just got down on it. Was you? It's bad. <laughs> oh, Who gonna, the fuck says that? You're gonna make me orgasm. Like, in at that least say cum or something yeah. like orgasm in that accent as well. Horrible accent. Horror, horror. And then, and then late, obviously, whatever. I stayed at hers, and then uh, later in the night, <laughs> fucking. Uh, obviously, I'm I'm asleep now. Laying next to her, I wake up at like five in the morning because science grabbing my foot. <laughs> Yeah, I'm uh, edge of the bed, trying to squeeze my big toe. So I'm like, I look down. It's uh, like a three-year-old kid squeezing my toe because he's waddled in the room. I'm over there. I'm like, yo, yo. She's gone, got up, gone, no, 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 come back to me. He's gone, dada? She's no, it's not your dad. Fucked. Fucked. You're just destroying that poor kid's life. That's her fault, isn't it? She's squeezing. 
Your foot. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, him. Dad, it, it squeezing my foot. Dad, dad. Mad. In it. Oh, poor. Oh, but no. He ain't going to remember it, is he? <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, you who the fuck I knows? I actually woke because up to really grabbing my toe, <laughs> bruv. She's probably doing this on a weekly. Like, probably. Boy squeeze. She'll think about how many toes that boy Mad. squeezed. <laughs> Every week, dad, dad, nah, it's not, nah, it's not him, it's not him. Still not him, mate. Yeah. Go on, fuck off. Yeah, fuck, fuck off. He squeezed my foot. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, he's busy now. Go on. <laughs> Go back to bed. Oh, mate. It was, it was, it was hilarious, though. It wasn't so, hilarious, but uh, I just felt better. Oh, I, I didn't feel awkward. I felt awkward for her. Did you sleep after that? Yeah. <laughs> it's not doing me, is it? It's her kid. Don't bother me. Right, he won't want to see, he won't to see me, home. It's a what, broken home. Yeah, Jeez, he won't remember that. It's a broken home. Until he gets to 11 and he's still doing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is a broken home. The way he said no, dada. And all my me, life he said dada as well. Oh, speak. No, do you know what? And she said, I no, feel, it's not I your feel dad. bad, yeah. I do feel bad. Don't get me wrong, but it's fucking funny. Yeah, it's ain't my problem. Because that's... <laughs> dad, ain't my problem. She's squeezing your toe to poor kid. I know. <laughs> dada. Mad. Mad. No. And then I had to drive home in the morning at 7.30. What the fuck am I doing, bruv? That's down bad. <laughs> You're probably thinking of how that night played out. Yeah, thinking, yeah. I've got this kid squeezing me fucking I've foot. had some mad stories, but <sighs> I can't. How does it always happen to me, bruv? Genuinely, you've actually got mad stories. I ain't got stories as mad as you. First of all, yeah, the, the Bosch story is crazy. Mad. This story, for example, <laughs> the girl who smelt. Oh, <laughs> oh God. Hot chocolate tongue. Two days. Burnt my tongue. Furry chat. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Johnny, I reckon it's the women, bro. But they're good looking. <laughs> they are though. It's what's on top, but you just, oh, so you uncover them. Not me, word. I'm going for the wrong girl. <laughs> so, but they're good looking. <laughs> Gotta make me whole gay zoom. <laughs> oh, am I? I'll stop. <laughs> don't, please. Please don't. Don't. Can you imagine don't. she did? Shut up. <laughs> yeah, fucking hell. <laughs> All right. Uh, next question. <laughs> Do you go bareback or wear Johnny's? And if you, if so, has it ever split on you? I'll be so real. I say it openly on camera. I don't think I wear condoms since I was 17. Be so real. Yeah, I can't But lie. I'm flying straight. Yeah. Nothing's lie. infected me yet. Nah. I just picked the right things. It's, what, it's, it's fucking it. It's miss, lucky isn't it? dip, innit? It's lucky dip, but yeah, man. And I've been tested as well. I get tested like every three months. Just to- Just to make sure. Make sure. Oh, I can't cool. lie, this cool. is so exposed. No, I was exposing us. We are saying not. Yeah, man, bareback, cool. Bear yeah, back. yeah. Most, <laughs> most men do. But you basically haven't even chopped if you wear a condom. Really and The truly. plastic's chopped It feels fuck all, bruv. It don't feel I'm right I'm not going to get there. Yeah, I ain't going to get there. there. I ain't getting get there. there. I ain't getting there. I ain't getting there. there. Has it split on me? Yeah. When I lost my virginity. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Swear down. Yeah. Same. yeah. Same. When I lost my virginity, yeah. Uh, and, and the first couple of times when I was sleeping with girls when I was younger, I'd wear a condom because that's that the thing to do. Yeah. Wear condoms, people. We're not trying to say yeah, don't, not wear, trying them, to say don't. Do wear them, but like it feels shit compared to not. It just does. Just like pull out. Play the game, man. You know what I mean? I, I pull out like a good 20 seconds before. Yeah, Stick nah, in a gob. <laughs> do you know? Because some this, people play with fire. It, some people like, oh, it's there. It, and then you that's just, it. stick it in their gob. <laughs> And then like Chuck. you pull out and then fucking like some people will pull out as soon as they're coming You've out. You've had a spray, a spray's gone off and then you, you can't, I don't trust that person enough. Especially even when they're saying, oh, come in me. No, no, I'm not. Even if you're on saying, it's not happening. Yeah. You know what I mean? Fucking hell. Them girls that actually want you to is a bit concerning. It is a little bit concerning. Yeah. It's scary. Mad. What, we're like 10 minutes in and fucking. <laughs> yeah, this is raw. I myself <laughs> Uh, what do you think about dropping game through socials? If so, Johnny, Johnny don't do it I that much. It. I don't really DM girls, really. Yeah, Johnny don't do it. Me, man's dropped game through socials before. Like, I got, I got no fair game few times. On socials, bro. I'm more of an in real life person. Yeah, I'd, I'd, yeah, I'd, I'd prefer in real life. But, I, you know, sometimes if I see a thing on socials, I can't lie. i has been in there. Yeah, but don't go nowhere more time. If, if everything goes banging on, on Insta, more time I think, well, okay, you don't like in real life. And then secondly, is like, it's just boring. It is dry. Like, we'll probably speak for three days and yeah. you. It's a thing where if we ain't linking up straight away, not or straight away, next, not like, like on a day, like in the next, next like, like however. Three weeks. Yeah. Then it's just like, fucking hell, it's going to get sour because I'm not just, I'm just chatting to you on DMs, a couple of voice notes go and back and forth. you're talking every like, day. Just chatting day, every day. Someone like, who's not your missus. Yeah, I don't even know you. Like, like we haven't even met before. It so. will go stale. Yeah, it will go mad you'll, stale. You'll, you'll ruin it. That, that's generally what I believe. Like, if you talk to someone every day 
um, and you ha- not meeting them or nothing over DM and you like, you still ain't decided, it will go fucking stale. I've yeah. had experiences where it goes stale because yeah. what's there to talk about? Yeah, you run out after a while. Just go link up, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And then when you see each other out, it's already gone stale. So it's like, no point. I'd rather not talk. Yeah, I'd rather not chat. You know to what I mean? In real life, you can kind of grasp. You can tell within two minutes if a girl fancies you. Yeah. Maybe sometimes not when they're playing hard to get, but still when they're playing hard to get, you still you can still tell. can tell a little something. You still can tell on DM. You can't tell nothing, bro. Mm. Can't tell nothing. Yeah. It's it's not good for the confidence. I will tell you that now. It ain't good for your confidence because you yeah. start reading into shit too much. And some, some yeah, you might you might misinterpret things. something as well. Yeah, That's exactly. The thing. Here's one. I just answer quickly. Why do you not hang around with a beta squad anymore? I do. Me too. It's yeah. not on camera. It's not on cam. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> With them last week. Some of these fucking questions. Sorry, wait, I've got to answer. Mate, how much money to sleep with your best mate's girl, but they don't know about the money for a year? Zero. Zero. <laughs> I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. They don't know about the money for a year. So you think once you fuck them and they find out, like give it a year after you say, oh, well, I did get this much money. Get out. And go, oh, well, all right then, mate. <laughs> fucking hell. Fair enough. Fair makes enough. sense. Makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> if you had a chance, would you want to be pain free for the rest of your life? No, let's break it down emotional and physical. Emotional, you need to feel emotions. Yeah. Because um, otherwise you're just fucking a sociopath. Yeah. And if you don't feel physical pain, you ain't going to know that you're hurt. Yeah. Imagine you're just fucking walking down the street and you, your liver's like fucking falling apart. You don't even know. You know what I mean? You need pain. You need to, it's signals, man. I, I reckon I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I can't lie though. Nah, nah, I don't want to be a social. Fan. I don't want to be. I don't want to be. Nah, fuck that, bruv. You need to feel pain to know stuff's wrong with your body. That's why we feel it. But emotional pain, though. Yeah, man. You still want to. This sounds tap, but I sometimes like feeling sad. Do you know what? That's a good. That's a good point. I actually sometimes like feeling sad. Like, because when I ain't felt sad in so long, forget. I start thinking, oh, bruv, like, am I like bare emotionless now? Yeah. Oh, did you cry? I ain't cried since my dad had cancer two years ago. He's I ain't sweet cried. now. I ain't cried for time. I ain't crying in time. Not. It takes a lot to make me cry. Yeah. And I hate that because when I was younger, even talking at like 18, 19, I used to, I wouldn't say I'd cry all the time, but like I was a lot more like susceptible to yeah. being emotional. I ain't cried. But then the thing is, I find it weird, yeah. And this is a mad, this is a good topic to talk about because I want to know how everyone else thinks of it. Like I, when I say I ain't cried, I ain't cried in time. Mm, yeah. Well. I try to. But I try. I thank you. I, yeah. I can't even lie. I'll say it now proudly. I've tried to cry and I can't do it. Same. The other day, yeah. I would say the other day it was Christmas, yeah. And uh, a Christmas movie come on. I was watching a Christmas movie, basically, yeah. And not to say a Christmas movie made me emotional, but I started, f- for some reason, I did feel- Nostrils started flaring. Yeah, I started going like, rah. But then it wasn't the Christmas movie that I was doing it. I think it was just like everything holistically. It, I was thinking about loads of stuff I'm altogether. I was banging on the night before. <laughs> Genuinely, I don't know what it was. I actually don't know what it was. But like, it was loads of stuff I was thinking about. And then I felt like the feeling of wanting to cry. And do you know what I did? I was like, yes. <laughs> I celebrated and it. Got, it. it goes. I celebrated. I was like, oh my God, yes, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to cry. Like, I was actually excited. Did it, it just it didn't goes. happen. It went straight away. It's like you're about to climax and yeah, it stops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mum's life is, is, is horrible. Like sometimes you actually need to let emotion out. Yeah. I wanted to do it. I was like, I was like, come on. I've got, this, I've got this weird internal prideful thing, which I don't even control. Um, but going back to when my dad was ill, like I said, he's fine now. But when he was ill, Obviously, my brother was crying. My yeah. mum was crying on, yeah. a, on, a, on her own in her room, and that it's bad, horrible times. Yeah. For me. Um, my dad's in hospital, um, and I'm like keeping it together for my mum and my brother. Yeah. Like I'm not ready. I, whatever. I go up to my room, close the door, try and cry. I still can't cry because them two are in the house, and subconsciously I don't want them to hear me. You don't want them to hear you cry. It's weird. No, but but I that's, cry. that's like me as well. So when they leave the house to go work. Then that's when think, I can cry. It's yeah, so weird. Like yeah. I even closed the windows just in case. No yeah, one just in case. Weird. Bro. Nah, it's weird. But that's because you want to be a soldier for your. You, you no, try but I don't even mentality. care about being like. It's, it's more do. like a. I, no, I I do, but it's more like a. It's not a choice. Yeah. Like I actually, it's no, just no, no. In me. For, for me, it's not. For me, it don't seem like a choice. Like like, like, I don't remember the last time I cried in front of my mom. I can't remember that. That's time. That's too long. Nah, yeah, I, no, I, I won't. Like, I won't do it because it's like, yo, I'm supposed to be there for you. Like, yeah. Do you know what I mean? But it's like, it's not even that you're choosing to like, I've got to be strong, got to be strong. Like I went up to my room, I wanted to cry. Yeah. I can't, cause I know that in case they hear me. Yeah, I won't cry. Weird. I won't cry. It's a weird thing. But then like, if, if men cry, I don't think it's a bad thing. Like, it's definitely not a bad thing. I think it's a good thing. I've had my boy before call me up on the phone and he's, he's, his life was getting bare stressful and that. And he's just venting to me. And he's like, just 
angry cried on the phone like he's like he's bawling on the phone yeah. and it made me feel like so loved yeah because he's called me up he let his guard, he let his whole his his guard down to, and he done it and i wasn't even really saying nothing i was yeah. just listening You're just listening but that's all they want at that time isn't it and it made me feel banging like you must bear rate me as a friend like, yeah to, to call yeah me to, do, to, that. to do that yeah like, yeah i think crying is is definitely needed um when yeah, that's a question one. but yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you were born you could only select one color that your eyes would see and that's the only colour you can see for the rest of your oh, life. Fuck me, what colour like... would you pick? Wait, so would everything else just be shaded out? For example, look at this sign, yeah? If pink was the only thing we could see, what would it, what would our eyes be like this? Would it just It'd be, be black and the black and white count as a colour? And it does, but like Yeah, let's say everything else is black and white. Okay. Oh man, I'm alright with that. <laughs> Like my my best mate's color, he's colorblind. Yeah, but that don't mean it's black gets, and white. That means he gets, he like, he sees, yeah, but he sees a lot of shit like. I would say, probably like a, I know this ain't a color, but a mix of like orangey, pink, blue. Sunsets. Okay. Sunsets. Oh. Sunsets. If I could see a sunset every night, cool, Christy. You like that, you like that, innit? Yeah, dusk. Yeah. About to see dusk, dusk is your favorite. Do you know what I mean? Looking at a sunset just makes you think. Oh, Calm. All right. That's all right. That's good. Yeah. Well, that's a. I agree with you on that one. To be fair, do you know yeah. what? Yeah, if everyone else, if you everything... could look at the sky and see the colors of the sky. Yeah, like... if everything else is black and white, is yeah, that'd be your little sign of hope. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean, <laughs> I agree with that. I'll, I'll get done with that. To be fair, go on. If every day one new thing arrived at your house, all of which begins with a letter you choose, what letter would you pick? M. Money. Money. <laughs> Every That's day it. I'm getting money. Every day I get money. Easy fucking answer. Easy answer. Easy answer. Easy as But then let's, let's think about... The but then what about if it's like a, a, a penny? Getting, what if it's a penny? Because that's money. outside your door, murder. Murders turn up at your door every day. <laughs> dead body every day. Is money coming with it? <laughs> oh yeah, it's true. Well, then you... you know what I mean? <laughs> what, what else with them? Let's, 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 let's play devil's advocate because yeah, cool money, but wait. I could turn thing? up at your door every day if you want. You're right. <laughs> It'd be late. Um, money. What if, wait, but what if it's like a penny? More life. <laughs> what if it's a penny though? Yeah, but, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ah, oh, a rack. <laughs> what if it's just like a rack? Like the, like what no, no, but I'm talking, I'm talking a rack. This ain't good. It's Bang already going. It's already going there. Five k a year for doing nothing for opening my door to the postman. It's all right, isn't it? Fucking hell. Post, uh, hey, I'll grind in cash. <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. You know I mean, I'll give him a fucking bulls, eh, mate? Yeah, yeah, mate. Cheers, yeah. You know what I mean, he's stopping on time. Buy yourself, sir. I mean, DPD wouldn't be missing my deliveries. <laughs> no, nah, definitely you know not. I mean, he knows he's getting a bulls out. Yeah. <laughs> Things start going missing. <laughs> what else could you turn up with Arlo? Yeah, let's not say that one. <laughs> oh, say that. Johnny, bro. Let's not say that nah, one. Because we got there at the same time. You know, that's yeah, let's not say that one. Oh, mate. Um, that's not yeah, me. yeah. Probably, probably <laughs> something to do with money. That's what I'd... Yeah, I'd probably have. Yeah. Something to do with money. Only. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Rolex. Oh. Rolex. <laughs> Get Rolex yeah. every day. Yeah. Yeah, there we now, go. That's better than money. That's better than money. Because you can shot it. You can shot the whole... Yeah. Even a, the even a entry level Rolex <laughs> yeah, is like, still yeah, talking like nine bags. Yeah. So you're you know good. I mean? Yeah, Rolex. I'd say Rolex every Rolex, day. Rolex, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Phew. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely just Rolex. If you were offered a pill <laughs> that could uh, that increases your intelligence by 50%, but also permanently removes your hair, including your brows, would you take it 100%? Would you? Yeah. I wouldn't. Why? I'm doing all right. I ain't the smartest. I'd have it. I ain't the smartest. I'm doing all right. I'll get rid of my hair for Look a Look at our good pal fucking Felipe, mate. He's thick as shit and he's doing all right. <laughs> you know what I mean? I think he'd be doing as all right if he had... 50% intelligence, but probably remove your hair. I'm taking that. I ain't. Get a hair transplant. No, but that doesn't count. You can't Wear a wig. That. Like, if you're unfortunately got alopecia, then, then life has dealt you a card which you cannot change. But if I had an option... To have no eyebrows, no facial hair, no head on my head. For f Actually, I don't know now I'm thinking about it. Yeah. Just get rid of that. Yeah. Let yeah. that go, man. 50% more intelligent. That's a lot. 50% more. Woo. Yeah, no, that's a lot. Yeah, I probably would. Yeah. yeah. Get that gone. Eyebrow eyebrows. Eyebrows a on. lot. And then get fucking, yeah, wet, just rock the skinhead. Yeah. 
I'm yeah. running no, that. No, no, I would, I would, I would, I would take it back. What would you teach if you had no choice but to teach? Are we talking school subjects? Or are we talking anything? School subjects, PE. Yeah, same. That's what I want. What, not music? Oh, shit. Yeah, I'd teach PE. Oh, no, wait, I'd definitely teach music. PE was the only lesson that I really proper enjoyed. In my school, on my set, uh, yeah. what was it called? Calendar? No, what would I used to call it? Front of your, front of your book. Like your rotor, oh. like your, your yeah. timetable. Timetable, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, every Friday, I used to have double, double PE, PE last lesson. <sighs> Go home in your kit. Yeah. Sick. Proper. Yeah, I used to have th sometimes double PE and then I had football after. That yeah. was a good, good, yeah. good end to the day. Yeah. Like, yeah, double PE, you go home in your kit, you go straight over to like oh, fucking park and good. start playing football with your boys. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, double PE, I think I'd... I'd, 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 I'd probably uh, do music, I can't lie. Teach. I'm like, My music teacher was definitely a nonce. <laughs> so I think mine was as well, I can't lie. My science his, teacher was his name well. was like, Gemini, I think he was. Nah, for real. Yeah. I think my PE teacher was a bit of a nonce. Most PE teachers probably are. Yeah. Girls, uh, 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 yeah. Get ready, oh, uh, get ready. Uh, 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 nah, uh, 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 I had a PE teacher, yeah. I'm not even gonna name because he was a cool geezer, but I actually think he's a bit noncy at the end, yeah. He's not that cool, then, is he? <laughs> he? He actually ended up moving to Australia, so. Probably on a fucking run. <laughs> so he he took all the girls' numbers what? when when we finished school. That's very weird. Yeah. That's bare weird. And then he started sending them messages, but obviously now. How old was he? Well, oh, he's in his thirties, isn't it? So then, but then here's the thing that like, here's the problem that he there was, was sending problem. it to the girls. Bear in mind, we was like 15, 14, 15, 15 ish, call it that, yeah. They'd like take a screen screenshot of it and put it on Facebook and that and be like, oh, he's so, he's, our PT teacher's so nice, whatever, not blah, blah, blah. He kind of exposed himself and then he left. Yeah, that is weird. And it's Very like the, the, the messages would be like, Oh, like it was a joy teaching you. Um, hopefully, we can meet up, whatever. Not see each other again, and blah nah, blah blah. Like, nonce. have a good, have a good time at he's a nonce. college or whatever. Um, so that or what? He's a nonce. Like, yeah, hundred percent. He's a nonce. That's I re weird. I reckon it was a bit nonce. That's strange. Though. Yeah, because he's selective on what girls he. he yeah, uh, then he's a nonce. Yeah, yeah. Or he would have been anyway. A bit strange. <laughs> I used to look at my PE. My PE teacher must have been like 21, 22. Yeah, yeah, young man. Yeah, like whatever. But I remember when I was in school, I used to think, fuck me, he's like a grown. He's a grown man. man. And then I think I see him when I was like 20 in Nando's. He must have been what, 26? 26, 26. I'm near 26 now. Yeah. And I think, was like, you was actually bare young when you yeah, were teaching. Yeah. He was bare young. He was, he was young, really. But like, I saw him as a big ass grown man. Yeah, he's a grown ass man. Do you know what I mean? Which he is 21, but yeah. like, do you know what I mean? Uh, would you be willing to have three fingers surgically removed if it meant you could never get sick again? Nah. Nah, I'll keep my fingers. Nah, I'll just, I don't really get sick. I just want to go through life naturally and I don't get sick that much either. Nah, I don't really get sick. Yeah. Nah. I'm good with that. Yeah, I bet I barely get sick. I don't even mind being sick. Can you sick. imagine? Just have these left. Yeah, I don't even mind being sick. Yeah. No, you can't do much, can you? Yeah, no. Can't do much, no. If you could have a, a thing, if you had to have a thing removed, what one would you have removed? Little one. Nah, Still. I'll go with this. Still got more grip. No, you ain't. You have. No, you ain't, bruv. I can't lie, this is this is important, you know. This That's little what monkeys have. This little ping. This monkey, little... No, monkeys have. How many fingers do monkeys have? <laughs> Crazy. Five or four. No, nah, look. Because I, I sound like a fucking idiot now. Think of it like this here, Johnny. Swear yeah. they do have three. This is important, bro. I got look. five. I can't. I got look, with this. Johnny, just try to use your phone without your pinky. Fingers do apes. See, look. Look at that. Look at what your pinkies are doing right now. The structure. Five. I am absolutely thick of shit. Why? Oh, I'm thinking about cartoons. Yeah, probably. That's what I'm thinking about cartoons and like get, that. Get rid of your little finger and try and use your phone. Yeah, because we're used to resting it on that. All right, all right. Now get rid of this finger and use your phone. So yours is just about using your phone, is it? No, but like That's for everything. All you care about for life, everything. Is using your phone. For everything, it works better. Shall I tell you why? You're... Actually, yeah, because it's gapped out. Yeah, the like... gap's there. So you still got that. You yeah, still got okay, that support. I hear it, yeah. Come on, man. I'm, I'm, listen. You thought, thought about, about this. this. <laughs> Keep shopping, night. Yeah. Literally. If so I was going to be in a kidnap situation, <laughs> if I got napped, I want this I'll one. Let, I want this one gone. Yeah. Get this you one. Gonna cut your finger off. Here. This one. This one. And I can still swear. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I've got, I've got it all. I still swearing that way. Yeah, still, yeah. This one, it's just marriage. Good point of people. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, I mean? what does that one do? If you get married, you're fucked. Yeah. If, especially if it's, just, if, it's the, if it's the left finger. Yeah, you basically. Oh, sorry, marriage. darling. Just got to put it on this one. <laughs> do you think anyone would still date you if everyone you dated could read your mind? <sighs> Probably not. I can't lie. I don't think so. Yeah, as long as I was able to explain myself. 
because like not being funny, we put a lot of stuff on this podcast, which is very like, yeah, I think right. when read your mind, I, I'm not a fucking sick individual where I've got like wrong things going on. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, everything that I think in my head, which is like sexual, is very explainable <laughs> and is like just what boys would talk about. It's not mm. as if I'm fucking thinking about, do you know what? Do you know what I mean? Mm. Or like that. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. I ain't a creep. So like, <laughs> no, do you know what I mean? It's, you, like, it's not the like- way it's, you mean, <laughs> The way you just, <laughs> Yeah, but it's not that deep. Like, if a girl thought, oh, you're disgusting for thinking about that. Yeah, but it's highly explainable. That's, what do most men do? Yeah, 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 yeah. You know facts, what I mean? Facts, facts, So facts. as long as I get to explain myself, I think they will want to date me. And I think if you wouldn't, it's a bit immature. Yeah. Yeah. If you meet a what, woman your age, what if 25, it's, what if 26, it's about, and, and she kind of cares that you've done certain things in life or, or done X, Y, Z, I think you either haven't been about in a sense of like, you ain't seen a lot of life. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or you're very ignorant. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. But what if it's just like, what if it's, I reckon maybe for stuff like, you know when you've got a problem with her and you don't want to explain uh, it. Ah, yeah. There's you that. Mine's just dirty. Yeah, yours is just dirty, man. Dirty, man. You've got a problem. Yeah, but no, but yeah, it's same yeah, thing. Yeah, but to be fair, it's, just same explain thing. it. I say it anyway. Yeah. I say I feel anyway. You know yeah. what I am? I'm very honest. Yeah, if you're I, very if, honest. I, if I, if I say fair, same. same. I'm just a bit t tame with it. Like I won't. I don't go all the way. Like something could be doing my head in and no, I'm just trying to do it as nice as I can. I just say it. I say it nicely, but I just say it. Like, so my family is, my family don't do sympathy. And my dad's ill at the minute, not ill, um, but he's got a bad chest infection. And yeah. he's like, oh, my chest is in so much pain. My mum's like, oh, get over it. <laughs> That's what we do in my family. We don't do sympathy. You know what yeah, I, mean? I hear it. I hear it. I hear What's it. the point? Yeah. So like, I just say it how it is. That's how we are. I don't really get offended by absolutely anything. Anything. Nah, to be fair, I'm good with that as well, yeah. I'm yeah. actually good with that. Like, I, I don't I, get That is my humour. One of my good, good, good mates, I've probably said this on a podcast before, fucking, his mum died when he was like 10 and all he does is joke about it. Yeah, he just... All he does is joke about it. I was pulling up to his ass the other day and on his drive, he's got three spaces. His dad... <laughs> it makes me crazy, bro. His dad's van was in one space and there's two spaces left. So I'm driving up, as you would, just to the middle space. But no, 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 don't park there, park on the left. I said, why? He went, oh, my mum might come back. <laughs> nah, okay, yeah. You know what I mean? And I uh, clocked and I was like, crazy, crazy. Uh, he's got... Yeah, but like, like, if you don't... Uh, he's don't got good humour still. Both. Yeah, yeah. You know got, what I mean? He's got good humour. Like, you can joke about anything with me. Nah. If you're my boy, you can joke about it. You can anything. joke about it, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 I you know can't I mean? like, let that happen. Like how well. I just said with your nan, bit, bit rude yeah, yeah, what I was saying, but, yeah. it's but a joke. You know it's a joke. You know what I mean? Which of your friends would you choose as a sidekick if you were a superhero? And what would your individual superpowers be? Let's just say we were superheroes, yeah? Mm -hmm. What would you want your superpower to be? So we don't, so we don't clash. Flying. Shit. <laughs> so let me go with that one. Shit. Flying. I can't lie. Why, why would you want to fly? Just go anywhere in the world. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Doesn't pay for no plane ticket. But you know what it is? Let's, you know what I always thought? I've always thought this, yeah? Being a superhero, yeah? Cool, I'd want to fly. I'd be fuming though if I couldn't fly very fast and I had to and I wanted to go like But that's I mean? floating then. Nah, but what if I couldn't fly fast, bro? Like I want to say for example, I want to go right, like let's talk bird speed then, because they're not super. Yeah, that's human. I'm fuming as well. What like pigeon speed? Nah, eagle. Eagle. You're speed. still you're still you're still doing a couple still, hours you if you want to go. Any situation. Imagine someone back to Shanghai and you're about to get stabbed. Yeah, you're off. But then you're but off. Then, you didn't float above and wank up. <laughs> But let's say I fancy, you know what I mean? I want to go Greece for a bit. I'm still in the air for, for a few hours, bro. I'm fuming. And imagine if it's cold you're, over the, when I'm going over the sea. You're fuming like you're flying. Yeah, just put on your goose or something. I'll be lit. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> it's cold up there, you know, Johnny. Yeah. Bear in mind, you're, you're kind of the goose. Just fly low. It. <laughs> well, it's not as cold. You don't have to go where the planes are at. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Or, I, always thought, I always thought about it. I thought about the downsides of everything. I thought, yeah, I want to fly. I'd be fuming if it was cold and I'm like Man's cutting fuming. Cutting through the air. Like, like oh yeah, you've ooh. been gifted with the ability to fly. I wanna go oh, I wanna, I wanna, I'm trying I'm to be go. cold. <laughs> I wanna go to Greece. I'm like this. Talk about pessimistic. On the way there. Fucking <laughs> 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 oh, oh. How long have we got? My life's so shit. <laughs> <laughs> and all I'm thinking about, I don't even know the way as well, bruv. Yeah, I don't even really know got, the way. Got ways. Yeah, but then, but, the then but then <laughs> but then there's no signal when I'm going over the Oh, but there's a lot to think about. Yeah, it's not going to be as clear cut. You've got to no, follow the true, plane. It's true, it's true. It's not true. as clear cut. You can fly, but there's a lot of, you've got, you got to map it out. Yeah, you, no, you do. Do you know what I mean? I'll probably just be a local superhero. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I can fly, but where, where you been this year? <laughs> uh, nowhere really. Didn't know where. Down a shop. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's a bit cold up there, isn't it? <laughs> mate, you can fly. Why are you not flying? Yeah. Oh, mate, you don't know. You don't... A bit cold. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Rather just stay Why don't you go Egypt or something? I don't know why. 
exactly. You try and see no, the light. That's right. true. Just it's true. Only break it down <laughs> and be in a realistic situation. I'm trying to be realistic about yeah. this shit, bro. I don't know where I'm fucking going. That's Johnny. funny. What, what other superpowers could you break down to see the negatives of? <laughs> Teleportation. Teleportation. How'd you fucking? How'd you get it right? No, nah, nah, because that's the whole point. You know where you're going. I think teleportation. Nah, that's a, I'm sorry about this. Teleportation I'm, is a better one than flying. It is. No, I'll tell you. What, I want to go Greece. I'm it, Greece. It cuts out all the. It cuts out all the bullshit. Like he mm. said. However, are you a master of teleportation? No, but that is just, yeah, it's a superpower. It's a superpower. All right, cool. So you want to teleport to Greece, right? You go. Right, sweet. So you, so you know exactly where you're going to end up. So you're not going to end up on the fucking runway as a plane's landing when you teleport. No. You're still in Greece. But then again, it would kind of be a bit boring. Yeah. Like you could just fucking go anywhere in the world like that. It takes the fun out of being at the airport. Oh. <laughs> Just, just pessimistic on everything. <laughs> nah, I'm thinking, of, bro. I'll be honest. I've thought about so. I've thought about this so many times, bro. I thought they they got to come with their their, their cons, bro. They Flying has a biggest con. No one can tell me shit. Yeah. Even though I'm still on a fly, I don't know the way anywhere. Word. Bro. You got all flies in your mush when you're flying. Yeah. Like, like, bro, in your face. Like, do you know what I mean? Like a flock of birds come at you. Oh, mate. Oh. If you ever want, no, I can't say that. I'll stay local. <laughs> I'll stay local. I'm saying local. Local superhero, bro. What about fucking, like even shooting lasers out your eyes must hurt. Yeah, that's fair. There you go. You're definitely wearing glasses, bruv. You're like Superman that. when he takes his things off. Yeah, that shit's got to hurt after. Got to, innit? It's like burning your, oh bro, trust me. Your retina's these, fucked. All these, it's finished. You know what I mean? All these superpowers. Cool, you can shoot lasers out your eye, but I can't see you two feet in front yeah. of me. You know what I mean? So, Who's there? So, listen, they all come with cons. They I'm do. telling you now. <laughs> Fly, Fly is the worst. Flying. Flying's <laughs> worst. Okay. Would you want to know if it turned out if you're in a coma and your whole life had been a dream? Oh, mate. That's going to give me bare anxiety. Yeah, if you turned out you're in a coma. What do you um, mean? Like, say for example. Oh, oh, oh. Like you woke up. Right now, right, we're right in a coma. Woke up. This sounds bare depressing. Um, but I sometimes struggle with that anyway. Like I sometimes think this ain't real. And I generally get in my head and think this is actually not real. No, I've and done I that loads of times. It. But then, do you know I what? Get depersonalization, I get, where oh I don't my. feel like I'm, I don't feel like I'm, life doesn't feel real. No, I've, I've I, I had that. it's hard to explain, but like. No, I know what you're talking about. I feel like I'm not in my body. I, I've, I've proper phase out sometimes and I'm like, I need to try and understand what the fuck's going on right now. Mm. And I like, and I like, oh, I, I go into like, like a yeah, mad, a spiral, mad spiral. But you actually think like, the other day, deep life. Yeah. The other day I was sitting next to my friend, I was sitting next to my friend and she was she was talking at me and I went into one of those spirals and oh my God, when I say my anxiety went through the roof, I started thinking about so much. I was thinking about so much shit, Johnny, bro. I was thinking like, cool, is this real? And then I was thinking, I started, like I started like doing this whole like, in the end I had like this massive spider diagram in my head, mm. trying to go down the roots to figure out like what is life yeah. about kind of thing. And I thought my, I had to just stop. I was like, oh my God, she was talking at me. She was talking at me for about 10 minutes and I was like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I was going into it, but I've done that before. Anxiety is a killer. It's dangerous. It's dangerous, bro. Don't do killer. it. You'll start talking yourself into some mad shit. Yeah, man. I hate it. Yeah. I just, I'm, I'm here now, innit? Let me just enjoy it. Wait, what was the, what, there was a choice or is it just? No, why the fuck would I want to know? I don't want to know. I'm enjoying what I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying, enjoying my dream. I'm just enjoying what it is right now. You know what I mean? That'd be terrifying. Imagine waking up, yeah? That's like, have you seen on, on like Joe Rogan podcast when like, uh, they talk about doing DMT and that. Fuck that. No, what's that? Oh no, some geezer smoked salvia. It's like some synthetic cannabis, not spice. I don't, mm. know, I don't really know what it is. I won't do that shit. Um, but basically, he, he smoked it on a pod or somewhere. I can't remember. I just see little clips of it. And uh, basically, the geezer went into a trip. He was only in the trip for eight minutes, but he lived underwater for, I think it was like 20 years, had a family, everything. His whole reality was real. When he came back around, he was like, ah, ah! like he forgot. That, he thought that was real. In his head, he was there for 20 years. But he no was there way. eight minutes. He was just like, ah, for eight minutes. Mad. And he thought, he thought. He had a wife, kids, everything. And then it all just like. It all just went. It all just yeah. come back to him. Like, oh my God, like I'm actually in the studio. Like, imagine oh that. shit. Imagine that. Like, I, I generally feel like I could grasp that. Yeah. Like I can actually grasp how that must feel. Yeah, no. Like, I right can... now, bomb, you wake up and it's like, whoa, whoa. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah. Where have I been? You know what I mean? Shit. Fuck that. Yeah, he was in a mini coma. I don't really fuck with them hallucinogenic shit. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's all scary. I ain't you might not do acid and that, you're tapped. Nah, nah. I'm fuck scared that. of that. Apparently when you do acid once, like apparently you just your whole life changes. 
You see, like, I don't know, one of my boys done it and he was like, oh yeah, I just see the world differently now. I do not want to see the world differently, mate. Yeah, same. Like, I'm all right with the way I am now. I can't lie. I mean, the world's shit, yeah. but like, bro, I don't want to At start least I'm self-aware. I'm not, yeah, yeah, I'm not going like, to over, I'm not deep in it all. Yeah, fuck that. Zombie apocalypse. What's your first move and what would you do to survive? Or would you just let them get you? No, why would I let them get me? Nah, I'm going to I'm gonna try to survive, but but let, let's say there is. Um, I haven't really thought about this properly, but I definitely have to just weapon up a little bit, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, just get a load of guns. A bit hard here, but I, know, I could get a rusty spinner from somewhere. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's, it's not as hard as what you think. Yeah, I get on my phone. I yeah. probably have one here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Probably get one here. <laughs> yeah, within um, the hour. No, I'm joking. Within the day. Yeah, within the day. Yeah, it was a little rusty one. Yeah, we I'm got just... even though we're not about our life. Got a couple. Uh, yeah, I got a couple of man I could call for connections. That. <laughs> yeah, uh, um, bad as that sounds. Um, but yeah, but he's yeah, board up my yard. Yeah, board it up. Are we talking fucking? I am legend zombies. Are we talking? If we're talking, I am legend. I think we're, we're pissed. If we're, yeah, if we're talking, I am legend. We're pissed because they're sprinting at twenty miles an hour. Yeah, yeah, but if it's like the classic, uh, I probably still go about my day. Yeah, there's fiends and fucking <laughs> Oxford High Street that fucking I'm used to in it. Uh, you know what I mean? I said there's fiends. Got the door here. Fucking there's fiends all about. There's fiends on Oxford High Street. You know what I mean? mean? You used to that already. Bodding about. I mean, instead of you want a pound, it'd be like let me eat your brain. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just go to America, everyone on fentanyl. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that, that fucking, what, what, uh, Skid Row. Yeah, Skid, there know. it is, Skid Row. Well zombie I, you see, Never I, been, but I've seen see, videos. No, I've seen videos. Bro, that look, they all like this. Why are they all like this? It all stand, yeah. fentanyl, innit? It all standing up like that. It's fucked. They must feel pucker. <laughs> innit, though? That they must do. They must. Why they keep bro, doing it? Bro, they're the maddest trip. Imagine like, they, just they the, give away everything for yeah. that. Just for no, just they for would. The pipe. They would. What's fentanyl? Did you sniff it? Pipe? What, I don't even it? know what it is. I don't even know. That's the toxic shit that people put in gear yeah, to, to, to chop make, it up. To chop and it they're up. doing it straight. Fucking hell. Bro, they, so if you go like this, it must feel good. Must feel good. Right. Like you deep it, yeah. Obviously, um, we're not condoning doing these things. Do not do them. They ruin no. people's lives. Yeah, but crack and brown must be unbelievable. <laughs> it has to be. Why are people hooked on it? I know it's addictive, <laughs> but like, it must be pucker. <laughs> them crackheads, they're, they're literally like fucking, they'll like, will suck you off for a bit of crack. Yeah. Like if you're losing your dignity that much, you don't see your kids, you don't see anyone, you're on the, sleeping on the street, people walk past you, you don't care what anyone thinks of you anymore. All you care about is the pipe. You're married to the pipe. <laughs> it must be unreal. You know what I mean? If I probably had an art, like 30 days to live, I'd probably try it. <laughs> nah, nah. This cat's lost his mind. It must be Parker. You've got to say, fuck it. Let's try yeah, it. Like, you've got to die anyway, innit? I bet it'd be Parker. Go out with a bang. You know what I mean? Go out on a high. Literally, I don't know if I can inject brown into myself. No, nah, bro, I'm not doing nothing. But I, I, I don't even smoke snout. I'd have a cigarette, bit of brown in it. <laughs> Go on a high, do you know what I mean? But if it'll park, I'd be like, yeah. What, just a 30 day spiral? Just literally yeah. hooked on it for 30 days, just straight. Just for the doctor to say to me, in the 30 days, are oh, you going to live? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Got an addiction now. Lost all my family yeah, and friends. Yeah, I ain't washed in two weeks. Teeth were falling out. Yeah. Some brown. Yeah, begging people for money. <laughs> Yeah, no, no, obviously, fucking our addiction's terrible, man. It's terrible. Like, it's terrible. it is terrible, but like, it just, you got to think about it. It must be Parker. <laughs> no, it must, no, it must be, though. I reckon. Think it, about it. Yeah, well, yeah. Okay, I, I think heroin's different because I've heard once you do heroin once, it's Parker, and then after that, you're chasing that first You're chasing bit the first high, and it's never the same, apparently. And your body actually gets ill to the, like, how, you, how bad is this yet? Apparently, if you do, I don't know about smoking it, but injecting it. Apparently, if you do it, inject heroin once, your body gets so dependent on it that from the first hit that you need it to otherwise you start getting ill. Like people that are, uh, uh, don't, are heroin addicts, when they're trying to stop, they actually get ill because their body needs it. Fucking it's fucked, innit? I don't think I'll ever be at a low point in my life to think, oh, I might try a bit of brown. Nah. that sort me out. Nah. Never. Never. But crack, I think crack is just an addiction. I don't think yeah. you depend on it. Nah, I don't think it's dependent. But heroin's dependent. I swear when you're coming off it, they give you little doses of it. To like, uh, yeah, I think they do, come yeah. down, come down slowly, slowly yeah. until you're nothing. Oh, mate, what? what? Oh. Yeah, fuck that. Thank God I'm not, I'm not on that end. So yeah. there you go. Yeah, <laughs> neither. But it must be Parker. Though. Johnny, it's like you're trying to give me a sign. No, like, no, I'm just saying it. No, after it this, be. mate, Johnny, no, just... no, but it must be though. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, it must after be. we record this, you're trying to slip yeah, up again. Yeah, mate. yeah, bit of pipe in it. That's right. <laughs> Crack <spliff. laughs> But on that note, don't worry, guys. We're not crackhead. I'm um, not condoning doing crack. Please. Um, I'm just saying in, in hindsight, like it must be banging. 
<laughs> Johnny you know said I mean? it about ten times. But, he no, sent yeah, a message yeah, to us, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you don't, don't see Johnny on the next the episode, crack. if you don't see him on the next episode, you know what. what At work, like. come on up. No, I'm sweet. I'm sweet. <laughs> Like, you got to start the next episode like that now. Listen, no, listen. I'm listening. <laughs> like the video, because you get me a pan. Then I like, need it for a bit of crap. <laughs> <laughs> nah, anyways, hope you enjoyed. Here every Wednesday, 4 pm. Like clockwork. Don't do drugs, kids. Talk to Frank. Yeah. Later. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do drugs.